you want us to empty? Yeah. Where was, where's the other? Oh, they're being all the Do you want to take that one? Yeah. I can do them both. Are you sure? Yeah. I still have to get some. All right. Science Across the City is our third annual day that we, all of the Step Up universities host all of our 10 Step Up schools and we bring them to campus to experience science um, at the college level and so at Boston College we have them working with terrapin turtles and we also are looking at the urban ecology of birds, particularly birds that exist in their neighborhoods. So that was the top. So the cool, do you want to try to hold them again? For your can you do it? Don't drop him though. Well, one of the advantages of using a live animal in the classroom, especially one that ends up using habitats that the students live in, is that it gives them a sense that they're neighbors with these animals. And it helps them understand that they have a stakeholder status. Um, these are not exotic animals that they see on TV. These are animals that can be in their backyard. They were really interesting. It was really cool to learn about them here. So it kind of gave me more information about them. We're going to focus on ecosystems. This represents a stable ecosystem. What is the state? What does stable mean? Yeah. Yeah. It's like it's healthy. It's controlled. Um, you have a question. Well, the challenge for us in this collaborative is to try and bring inquiry to the science classroom. Teachers are incredibly busy. They're overwhelmed with the amount of curriculum that they have to finish in a given year. Um, they have to meet state standards, and often there's hardly any time for the kind of exploration that actually gives students a real feel for science. And so we can do that. As practicing scientists and educators, we can bring that experience to their classrooms.